Back to politics now and the hundreds of thousands of dollars spent by GOP hopeful Newt Gingrich and his wife at the upscale jeweler Tiffany's. NBC senior investigative correspondent Lisa Myers has more on this story. Lisa, good morning to you. Good morning, Matt. Newt Gingrich has always described himself as frugal and physically conservative, which is why this story about a huge line of credit at Tiffany's just won't go away. His latest effort at damage control is a statement from Tiffany's explaining how Gingrich managed to buy as much as a half million dollars in jewelry, pay it off over time, and not pay any interest. Sparkling diamonds and an iconic blue box have worked magic for men for decades. But for Newt Gingrich, not so much. He and his wife Callista have been dubbed the Blingriches. Late night hosts have had a field day. $500,000 at Tiffany's? There's a simple explanation. The guy clearly buys his engagement rings in bulk. People give me a little key ring from Tiffany's. Half a million dollars? The questions just keep on coming. It was an I mean, who buys account? a half million dollars worth of jewelry on credit? No, you, it's, it's a, go talk to Tiffany's. It's a standard, no interest account. What's it's a normal way of doing business. We are very frugal. We, in fact, live within our budget. We owe nothing. Tiffany provided NBC News with a statement, basically confirming Gingrich's account and saying it routinely offers interest-free borrowing for up to one year for creditworthy Tiffany customers. Still, experts say very few Americans could qualify for the same deal Gingrich got five years ago. In order to get this type of deal, you have to have great wealth to qualify for a quarter of a million to half a million dollar line of credit at Tiffany's. Though Gingrich has declined to reveal what he bought, the strand of diamonds Callista Gingrich is wearing here looks quite similar to this one in the Tiffany catalog. Price, $45,000. Political analysts say that just as John Edwards became defined by his $400 haircuts, Newt Gingrich risks becoming known for bling, which may make it even harder for the candidate to relate to voters struggling in a fragile economy and working to pay off their own credit line at Sears. Look, most people don't have homes that cost $500,000, let alone jewelry bills of that amount. Uh, it's not something that people can relate to. Gingrich says he just doesn't get what all the fuss is about. Saying, I'm, I'm totally mystified. I, I owe no personal debts, none. Close and I have paid off our house, we paid off our cars, we run four small businesses, we happen to be successful. We asked Gingrich's spokesman for his comment about all this, and he told us the Gingriches have a right to spend their money the way they want and a right to give the gifts they want to give. It's their money. Matt? All right, Lisa Myers in Washington. Lisa, thank you very much.